Hey Nyako here, welcome to OB Studios. In today's video, I want to show you the top 5 premium template from the Breakdance Design Library that you can use to beef up your website like today. So these templates are the best of the best and they will help you create a professional and stylish website that will stand out from the competition. So let's get started and see what these templates have to offer. Alright, so our first template is the architecture template that comes from the design library. Alright, so this template I believe is the best one on that design list. If you haven't checked it out, please do yourself a favor and check this template out. It comes with all the new design sets, like all the things that you do see around with people playing around with pictures and things over this. You can see all of that right here in this design. I'm just going to go down to show you some of how the layout is laid. If you are an architecture or if you are into any kind of buildings and other stuff like that, I believe this is a design set that you might want to go through and see what you can get for yourself. I think this is their best templates on the design list and I think you should check it out and see whether there's something here for you. Um, let's look. Let's look at the the header over here. So the menu it works pretty well. Like as I said, this is the best design. Um, this is what you might pretty much want to use if you're looking for a design set. Like this is the best out there when it comes to their design set from Breakdance. Um, I like that. I like that. Uh, I want to show you more of the other pages. They have news and promotion too. This is pretty good. Not bad. Um, yeah, so this is design number one. The next one is this real estate one too. So this one is very similar to the last one, to the first one, which we talked about. But this is more of if you are selling stuff. So if you are into selling buildings and other stuff like that on the spot, you want people to see the price. You want them to get to you and you want to give them a quote. This is the library for you. And I think this is number two on the library set. Um, yeah. And if you want to really get this library set, you have to have the pro version of Breakdance. You have to have the pro version of Breakdance for you to be able to use it. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go through and I'm going to show you like a few stuff. Like book. It has all of these things in here, which is pretty, pretty, pretty nice gives you the square feet and then other property um, information, which is really good. Um, going back, you can go to, let's go to the about me. Okay, the about us is also pretty good. There's a blog over here. There's a team section over here. Um, let's look at your services. You do want house buildings. Not, not bad, no, not bad at all. Yeah, membership has a pricing. One thing that people really find difficult doing is pricing table. And this one did it really well. So, yeah, there, there's so many other pages that you can go through here. But I think this is number two. All right. The next one is the law and order. This one is pretty nice. Um, probably um, number three or number four in between there is what it leaves out. But I think number three is okay. It, it also has like a modern feel to it. It's not. It doesn't look too templatey. It doesn't look like. Someone didn't take time to do it. It has a bit of class and elegance to it that you can copy. You don't, when it comes to like these templates, you don't really have to use the entire thing. You can definitely just copy a few portion of it and use it for your own website. So that is really good. I, I'm, I'm really digging this one. It's pretty nice. We can check up on some of the pages here. There's an about page. About page is nice too. It has the same filler as the other pages. There's an attorney page. Uh, there's the Atoni pages. Mm, okay. You see that? There's a few interactions over here, which is nice. I love um, I love any kind of animation. I love any kind of... There's a case study part. Um, okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. That is pretty good. You might have to just populate some of these things. Um, okay. Insurance law. Okay, talk about the law and because of these templates that's why it goes missing some of the time but this is number three on your list the next one that i want to show you is this beauty um template 
as you can see, most of these templates have like full um, website sections. You have like about me, contact me. You can look at your contact me page. You can put uh, your own information here as you want. You can go to the service section page. It has all this information here, which is pretty, pretty nice. Um, there's the about. Also has this page over here. And then this is the shop. All right. This is not bad. This is definitely on number four. Um, and then we do have this cleaning page over here, which I think is number five on the list, which is number five on the list. And over here, you do have, I think you have a contact page that works fine. Um, I think that the bottom of this part, you can go back to the home page from here. Yeah, you can do like no more enter into this page it does have like other information here that you can also get more information so this template works it works pretty nice i'm gonna go back again it has um this before and after thing that most people do like and uh, there are little little things over here that also makes it pretty 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 good so this is my uh this is my top five from the design library i'm gonna go back into and then show you all the design list over here. So when you go to the back end of your WordPress dashboard and go to breakdance, go to design library, there's um, a lot of design shit that you can pick, you can take, you can change, you can swap it for whatever that you want. And let's say you found a design that you like. Let's say you do like this design. Um, let's say the insurance law, right? The law and order, you do like that. When you go back to your WordPress website, you can just go in. If you have the um the pro version of breakdance you can go and go to the design library this is only for beta one or beta 1.2 i think is version breakdance version 1.2 beta 2 or beta 1. if you have one of those betas you'll be able to see it um don't use beta on a live site because there might be issues with the beta and you really do not want your website to be effed up um, yeah, but this is how you get to the design library and you can import. So let's say you're trying to set up a new website. You set it out one for yourself or for a client. You can just go in here, show it to the client, which one they like. If they like any of these, you can just come to this part. And then over here, let's say we do once the, which one did we choose? The law, the insurance law one, right? The law firm one. So let's try the law firm one. Let's look for the, so this is the law firm one. What you can do is just click on import. When you click on import, you are going to receive um, a warning message over here telling you what is going to happen. So if you do like it and you want to continue, just click on confirm. And then you're going to see information about these things being imported to your website. After you can close it, you don't have to do nothing. Just go to pages and everything should be there. Probably the pictures might not be there. You might have to import your own pictures, but most of the things that you need will be there. But as you can see, everything is here. I can click on edit, click on edit. And then in the editing section over here, I can change the image to look as what I want. So I can change all these images over here. I can go and if I do have images, I can just do that over here. But you can see one cool thing over here is that the images from the, the design library is not imported into your own website. So you don't have to do the work of going into your image and then your image portal and deleting pictures that you don't want. None of the images are important. And the only thing, the only things that are important are the text and the design and also your global settings are tweaked to reflect what you imported. So if you want, you can go in and then you can change everything. So all the colors here, you can just come in and then just change everything here to reflect what you want. Yep. So you can use your brand colors, whatever that you want. You can do that. Um, you can come in here. Yep. <laughs> we are not really doing anything good. We're just trying to see how this looks and other stuff like that. But yeah, so you can change the pictures for yourself. It's really bad. Yeah, but you can change the pictures for yourself. Then yeah, you, you can make it look and feel the way that you want. And then you can also change the text. You can change whatever the font that you're using. Uh, I think if you go to typography, 
I think the uh, the font presets here that you can move to this side and then you can change all the fonts to reflect what you want. They're using Sora. You can change that to something else. So that's uh, my top five templates from the design libraries. And this is also how you import and also make changes to it.